Hi, Sagittarius. Welcome back, everybody. Let's get right into your message. All right, I hope everybody is having a blessed day. I am sending love, light, and healing energy to everybody who's reciprocating the same energy back. Okay, because you know you got people who you're trying to send love, light, and healing energy to, and they wish negative on you. Okay, so that's why I said to recipro who's reciprocating it back. Okay, so let's get some messages, Sagittarius. We'll pull three cards out of this deck here. Okay, what's the message here, please, for Sagittarius? And then we're going to pull some more energy after that. Because this deck is, I don't know, I like it, but I don't know. So we have the Six of Pentacles, the Hermit, and the Page of Cups. Okay, you got a crush here, Sagittarius. You, you, you got somebody here that, that you secretly like, you're secretly crushing on. Somebody is willing. You would be even shocked, Sagittarius, because whoever this person is, or this person would be shocked. Okay, because you are actually willing to accept their offer. This person is hiding in the background or in the shadow or like this is someone who works in the back. Okay, so like this could be at your job or they work like by themselves or something like that. Like they work by themselves. They don't. So this could be an entrepreneur or something of that nature. Okay, this could also be someone. Um who you are actually helping they're helping you or you are you buy you go to their store they come to your store they buy something you know you're you're purchasing something from this person in some kind of way or vice versa but they are hiding the fact that they like you or they they look at you in this way okay very interesting here Sagittarius all right someone is also going to tip you off or like give you some sort of like money up under account or up under a name that you don't know um or they're gonna someone is gonna if this is not like money somebody is going to like gift you something but you're not you this is like a game that somebody wants to play they don't want you to know that they like you so that they go they're gonna hide behind the shadow and give you something the six of pentacles look when look what i say hide behind the shadow this is fucking crazy. I like these cards. Never mind. I just changed my mind that quick. Because I feel I, I feel the connection with the cards already. Okay? Period. So, this is the Five of Swords, though. Okay? So, this is someone who is, who is either... They pretending to... Um, to, I'm getting two things with this person. This is someone who is pretending to be married. Like they, this is someone who is pretending to have a girlfriend or a wife or a husband or a boyfriend. They don't. They're single. For one. For two, this is someone who is going to reach out to you under a man account, but they're really a woman. Or they're going to reach out to you up under a, a woman's account, but they're really a man. But they are just, or they are sending you a friend with Chris with the Page of Cups. Like, somebody is very strategic of how they come towards you. You you literally have, like, a hidden, I want to say stalker, but you have, like, somebody that's hiding behind the shadows and they like you, but they are trying to, like, observe you first before they just fully approach you in that manner. You can always be in, like, communication or contact with this person some sort of way when it comes to them buying something from you or purchasing or when it comes to, like, friend requests. They sent you a friend request, y'all. You talk to this person on some sort of app or something. Yeah, we have the Page of Swords. Okay. Yeah, watching, gathering information. Okay. Trying to see what's up. <laughs> wow. Okay, listen. Okay, so I'm actually going to use these cards. Let's see. What is the hermit here, please, for Sagittarius? The moon card. Somebody is definitely hiding, Sag, who they really are. Okay. This is someone who have a crush on you. The Page of Cups, the Knight of Cups. Ooh. Somebody really like you. What's the Page of Cups, please? What's the page of cups? The empress. Yeah, somebody adore you. This could be also a woman who adore you, Sagittarius. You could be a male energy or, the, or a female. 
all right but i feel like somebody is um they just adore you they look at you like you're perfect or they just feel like you you are really um just nurturing you come off as somebody that's nice nurturing understanding well put together elegant you smell good sagittarius i feel like they even like your scent Or they like the way you pose. They like the things that you share or pose or comment or things like that. So I like, man. So yeah, someone is going to, they, they checking for you. Yeah, you got the Empress, the Queen of Wands. Man, somebody feel that energy all you. Like, ah. Ooh, Sagittarius. <laughs> they feel the confidence coming from you or they, they just know that you would be a good woman. Okay, even if you don't feel, you could be just the six of pentacles right now. Somebody like, man, I, I can see, I can visualize them being into the empress or emperor. I know Sagittarius can be more like, like somebody willing to even invest in you. That's what I'm picking up on for some of you. I ain't going to take that one because it's going to come out with the six of pentacles, which is the very smooth. It can be seven of pentacles as well, but what's the six of pentacles? Okay, this is really, I like this reading. It's very like calm. What's the six of pentacles here? For some of you, you also could be dealing with a Libra who's going to apologize to you or your mother. Now, I'm also getting here to you. For some of you, there is a Cancer or a Pisces who's hiding something or a Virgo. You feel like this Virgo is being sneaky. Or this is this is the Virgo who, this is a Virgo or a Cancer who is, who has this crush on you, Sagittarius. What's the Nine of Pentacles? Does somebody really like you? Yeah, we have the full card. Okay, so somebody is willing to um, take this leap of faith to give you something or to support in some sort of way. Are they about to take this leap of faith to reach out to you or say something? So we have the Ace of Cups. Okay, so here's somebody. This is new love, new opportunity. So you have somebody, Sagittarius, who like you, who's really into you. Okay, I feel like they have either did they research on you already with that hermit and that moon. They know a lot about you already. Okay, they have just been standing back up, admiring you, gathering information. And now here, I'm getting someone that's ready to take that action. Okay. Might feel like you would be a good fit for them or something of that nature here. All right, so we have the emperor, but it's the manipulative emperor. We have two emperors in his deck. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Okay. Someone is going to send their peoples to you. Or someone is going to... Hmm. There is some sort of manipulation that's involved in whatever this is. We have the high priestess. Or there is many people involved in this situation okay so this is also somebody who feels like um they have to be strategic okay Sagittarius or they have to come out very silent because of who they are so for some of you this could even be your boss okay this could be somebody you work for hmm very interesting for some of you this could be um a, a a a famous person with the emperor they are very well established they can pull strings and get shit done behind the scenes with the hermit i mean the emperor and the high priestess wow if this is not like on a romantic level somebody wants you to work for them like or Let's see, what do this person want from Sagittarius here? Very interesting reading here. What do this person want from Sagittarius here? What does the emperor, what does this emperor want? Okay, wow, this is way too many. What is this emperor trying to create? Or what is it that they want from Sagittarius? What do this hermit emperor energy want? Let's see. Okay, so the Ace of Pentacles and the Justice. Okay, yeah, no, this is definitely somebody who wants the real, like they want realness with you. They come in with, you know, um, some sort of opportunity, maybe. They're trying to offer you some sort of opportunity 
or they just want a new beginning with you, Sagittarius. They willing to pay for things, invest. This is someone who wants you to, they want to give you justice. They want to be able to put you in a good light um, for some of you, but they just have to do this strategically first because of who they are. I'm just keep getting it. So this is really good. I love this. So what is the emperor doing here? Okay, so this is what they have to have. They have to come like on a on a different level here or something. Maybe they are married or whatever like that. What is so that if they are trying to bring you justice, support, help, love, caring, the ace of pentacles and a justice. Okay, so what do they see? Are they trying to bring you some sort of they want to like they want you to come work for them, but they had to fill you out first. But this is someone who can pull strings. Like they got a lot of connections. I just have to say that. So I'm not sure how this person found you or how they know you, but just know somebody is definitely looking into you and they eventually gonna work. It's nothing bad, nothing at all. None, none of this is bad. None of this. But let's see, give me more energy on the Emperor. <laughs> They're the Eight of Pentacles. Yeah. Work or work with you or build something with you. This is somebody who's ready to build a solid foundation. Just period. Okay, the Six of Swords. Here they come, Sag. They ready to... And you might have to move from your current job, your current work, or this is somebody that's going to... Okay, baby, please. Somebody come with business. Look at this. Seven of Pentacles investment. Somebody is ready to grow a whole foundation, baby. Something that's very fruitful. You see all this on this tree? Okay, all these strawberries. What else on here? Okay, we got strawberry. That's all I see. A cherries or something like that. I'm cherries. Okay, so we got... um. Look at these beautiful flowers, roses. Like somebody's ready to build something. Ready to invest or build something beautiful with you. Or they want you to come work for them. But I'm definitely getting some... We got the death card. Things is going to change after this. Because you have to move. Somebody wants you to leave your current job. Okay? And somebody's expecting you to just... With the full card, it's almost like someone is just almost sure you're going to take this. So that's why I keep saying for who someone, somebody is very, they very known and very popular. A lot of people know this person already. Can you give, please give us some information on who is this emperor exactly? Who do this, what did this person do? Who is he or her? So the three of wands. I feel like this is somebody has that's connected around the world or connected in high places, high buildings, or um okay, so what's the three ones for exactly who this is someone for overseas, maybe for some of you. Okay, so the world. <laughs> yeah, I feel like this is someone who's world renowned. This period, the ten of cups. Yeah, this person is very known, very popular. Okay, Sagittarius, wow, I'm not sure what you do for work or who you are. This is someone who, like I said, for some of you, this, this is somebody who got like a real crush on you. Are you on Instagram, Sagittarius? For some of you, you post really good pictures on Instagram. You're an Instagram model or this is your boss, okay, or something like that. For some reason, they feel like they cannot, um, which of course, if it's your boss, then we understand. But whoever this person is, if it's not your boss, this is somebody who feel like they have to be kind of quiet, What's the moon card? Okay, so we have the king of pentacles and the king of wands. Okay, so this is someone who is a leader or somebody feel like they, they got the half this from two males. Okay, so this king of wands and this king of pentacles, somebody feel like they have to hide this from them or from you, Sagittarius. Or, I don't think the King of Wands is you, though. Who is the King of Wands? Who is the King of Wands here? Okay, so we have the Five of Pentacles and the Nine of Swords. And then we have the Emperor. So this is an Aries. Okay, we got the other Emperor coming out. Or your ex-husband or something like that. Wow. So somebody know your husband or somebody know this Aries or somebody know... Mm. This got something to do with your job, your word. They can't, they can't, or you used to work at this job, Sagittarius. This is your old boss or something. Okay. 
maybe for some of you, you don't really even know this person personally. I, I say that because how long somebody, I don't know, it's like somebody been watching for a while, but they have not been saying anything. So the Hermit, the Moon is giving me like, they have a lot of eyes though. For some reason, I feel like this person can have many accounts or something of that nature. This is a very, 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 very interesting reading. Like for real. Someone spent a lot of time watching you. I don't know, Sag, who this person is. It's saying that this person is known though. They, they are well known around the world. Wow. Okay, so I asked what this person want with you. They said the Ace of Pentacles. So they want to give you an opportunity and they said the justice as well. This is someone that actually wants to bring you justice. This is someone who you used to work around, maybe Sagittarius. Someone who used to work around. Something about work. Okay. Wow. So what's, what's the advice for Sagittarius? So we have the Knight of Pentacles in the reverse. What's the advice for Sagittarius? The Three of Cups and the Nine of Cups. Interesting. Okay. All right. So the advice for you, Sagittarius, and we have the Hangman. They are saying if you do decide to do this, to don't try to have a third party with somebody like they like try to don't be the per stop like you're gonna have to okay so i don't know why i'm saying this so maybe you somebody who you the type of person who you always juggle or you like to have more than one okay they are telling you to don't do this slow the energy down where you like the third parties the nine of cups you like to get what you want this could also be like uh, let's see, give me what's the, for what's the advice. Something you got to release something. Yeah, we have the five of cups and the nine of pentacles. Okay. Or they saying, so the advice is. Okay. So this is something that they, the three of cups, uh, this is something that they don't want you to gossip on or want you to tell. Yeah, that's what I was getting just at first. So this is something that only you can know. Okay, so. Um, yeah, we have the judgment. Um, hmm. Or when it comes to your independency, they are saying to let this person help or something like that, to release and let this person help you <clears throat> if they do want to help or something. If you have to do a lot by your by yourself or something like that with the hands of the judgment, they are telling you you don't have to do that anymore. Let this person help you. The Knight of Pentacles in reverse is like you can take a break. <clears throat> so somebody, so I did ask, what do this person want from you? And the Ace of what do this person want with you? And then the Ace of Pentacles came out. So, okay, this is somebody who they wants to give you some sort of support financially, just materialistically, whatever, emotionally. However, which the Pentacles is not necessarily about emotion, but the Justice card came out with it. So. It's almost like this is somebody who wants to, could be trying to do this in all areas. You see what I'm saying? So the advice is for you is to let somebody, like, uh, allow this person to help you. So this is someone who I feel like that they even agree with. So I'm not sure. Okay, so we have the King of Pentacles. Okay, so we have the Chariot and the Four of Pentacles and they also said to don't keep this. Okay. They said to don't open the door if the last one not closed. <laughs> so some of y'all already got somebody. You got somebody said or something like that. So you got to be weary of that. They want you to think about that as well. Okay. But they also said keep your mouth closed. I don't know who this person supposed to be, honey. I don't know. This, this is a job where you can't say nothing. That's the only thing. Like... 
You can't tell people you with this person. If this is a job, this could be a romantic thing. Okay, though. Like I said, maybe this is somebody you work with, work around or something like that. I'm more so getting romantic, though. Crush, like. Now, it could be something like that. Maybe you, you, somebody wants you to come work with them. Like, so whoever this person is, whatever this, this job is very quiet. It's a quiet job. You can't say nothing. Okay, I feel like. They're real serious about this shit. With the King of Swords, High Priestess, Four of Pentacles, you cannot say anything about working with this person on what, however they go. I am getting with the Ace of Wands and the Cherry. You're going to take the job. Or you're going to be willing to, you know, be quiet or whatever this is. If this is not a job, this is romantic. This is a love offer, period. This is someone who have a crush on you. They love you. They, I mean, not love you. They like you. They want to. They just want you to be around them. It's going to be somebody who wants you to be around them while they work. But they just like, can we just please keep it between us or something like that? They just want you to just keep it between y'all. Yeah, I don't say nothing. That's all I'm getting. Like, it's just the point. Just, this, just, it is what it is. This is like what I'm getting. This is like a hush thing. Yeah, the high priest is the devil. The eight of wands. They, they don't want you to say nothing. Not a. Okay, my love. Period. And then it's six of months, but I'm getting they willing to give you whatever you want. I don't know who what the, <laughs> this is almost like hush money, bitch. What the fuck? <laughs> what who is this? That just really got me want to know what Sagittarius. This is almost giving me like hush money, baby. What is going on? Okay, somebody like man, yeah, just be quiet. I'm gonna pay you to be quiet. <laughs> what? But this is somebody who is. Okay, this is giving me vibes. Now hold the fuck on, y'all. Oh, give me them. This giving me vibes. Where is Sagittarius at? Okay, so the seven of wands, the two of swords, the four of wands. So you somewhere in the ten of swords. So you just, you somewhere going through a situation with um. You go through a situation with your house, or you're going through a situation with you just in the house. You don't want to talk to nobody, sound like me. Or, <laughs> or you just in the energy of, I don't know, you're going through situations with you feel like you've been betrayed here at home or something. Or you feel like this is lie. You feel like this is a lie <laughs> or something. <laughs> or something, somebody here. Okay, that's what I feel. That's what I'm picking up on. Okay, so we have the Queen of Swords and the Death Card. Or you feel like you don't know what you should do with this air sign. Should you walk away from them or something like that? Okay. Two of Swords. So you're somewhere with a bad choice to make when it comes to this, whatever this is. Okay, so yeah, the Two of Pentacles. Yeah, I'm definitely getting your going back and forth. Oh, should you want to walk away and leave all this behind? The Wheel of Fortune, yeah, you like, I'm, fuck this. I'm finna take the Eight of Cups, the Wheel of Fortune. You like, I'm finna go and take this. Go follow my path, honey. On my, this, you feel like this is your fortune, shit. You feel like this is what you're supposed to be doing. This is a part of the tower. You feel like this is it for you. So you going you, I'm getting, you gonna try to, you gonna, you out of here, period. You gone. <laughs> I feel like too. Yeah, I don't know who this is reading for, baby. This is like a one or two people because we know everybody. <sighs> baby, this is a once in a lifetime situation. That's all I'm trying to say, and this don't happen to everybody. And I'm not trying to be on here selling no hopes or dreams, baby. But um, baby, somebody is. Yeah, you you'll be surprised. You don't even know who's gonna hit you up. This part, this person is it, baby. I don't know. So let's see. Let's get a little oracle for you, Sagittarius. I know it's, there's a lot of talented people, though, that, oh, it's a lot of talented Sagittarius. It just be tripping me out sometimes. Like, I'd be almost goddamn shocked. But I even, I'm just be happy to know a lot of y'all who are doing, like, I'm like, man, for real. The ones who don't show me their work and send stuff to me and show me and stuff of that nature, their music, I'd be almost shocked how good people is, for real, for real. Okay, so let's see. All right, so we have stretch and expand. Yeah, somebody wants you to come out with them and work with them. Yeah, we have beloved romance. It says prepare for your life partner. Romance is returning in your relationship. Wow. 
<laughs> and we have leadership. Yeah, this is somebody who is a whole motherfucking leader who is in a high position that's going to reach out to your ass, Sagittarius, baby. And they want you to um, come work with them, stretch and expand. Yeah, we have sparkle and shine. Give me one more here. Oh, wow, Sagittarius. This is crazy. So we have adventure and partnership. What I say, it says, uh, move to a new location, manifest your travel dream. So this is something you manifested, baby. But some and we have partnership. Okay, build a talent support system. Teamwork will give you a better results. Find trustworthy people to work with, and we have discernment. Yeah, like I said at the beginning, this is 